All righty. Back to drilling beans today. I got started yesterday. I got uh, got the field furthest away from the house done. So I wanted to get that knocked out. And it was actually the driest of all of them behind this one. This one's still got two wet spots in it, but I'm not going to bother waiting to get it to dry out. There's one right there in the corner and one up there next to that waterway that's an, always a wet spot. But I got started over here last night and I was planning on running until I got it done, but got to be about 9 30 and it got really dark there wasn't any stars the moon wasn't out nothing and I couldn't tell what was co-emulter tracks and what was tire tracks from the drill so I quit before I had a bunch of skips and misses and it doesn't help that this this field's got dark ground to begin with so I wanted to get over here a little earlier, but the more I got to think about it, it's like it's Sunday morning. Yesterday was nice, so people were still out. Their people were kind of out a little later. I don't think the natives would appreciate it if I was out here at 6 o'clock in the morning drilling beans. Plus, I got up when my or tried to get up when my alarm went off and couldn't do it. So I'm over here at seven instead of six. Plus, I did look out the window at six and it was still a mite bit dark. So. I'd probably had trouble seeing them tire tracks again this morning anyway if I came over here that early. Should be able to get quite a bit done today though because my buddy Cody from school is coming up. Because he's from down in Lagodi, Indiana. They're still getting rain down there so he can't go home and work so he said he'd go up here and work so. Put him and dad on the tractor finishing and I'm going to keep planting. I got one, one more bean field that I want to get, I, well I need to get done today. And it's that. It's that one that's the old hay field. Since I can only work there on, well, I can't work over there on Saturdays because it's seven day event. Just my luck, this is going to be the last nice Sunday we get. So I want to get over and get that one done and out of the way, and then I might switch the corn. We'll have to see how the day goes. Guys are still drill, still use a drill to put beans in or wheat or whatever. Make you a set of those. They make life so much easier. Better than trying to eyeball it.
aircraft at night. When there's times during the day when the sun's just right, you can't hardly see them during the day because the, the light will make the entire field turn one color. And same deal, you can't tell what's what. Yesterday, I uh, 
got behind another guy heading home from planting. That was freaking weird. Brand new case four wheel drive with a looks like it must have been a uh, 23 year old Kimby split bean planter. Followed by this thing. Don't mind me, guys. I'm just here doing my thing. the day doing safety training. Uh, hell yeah. But I expected it. That's what happens when you get a job in industry anymore. Dawn of the day for the guy can show up to edit an interview at 8 o'clock and be working by 12. This was really interesting though. First, I had to go online and fill out a bunch of forms. Had to give them a bunch of information so they could perform a background check, which went through a third party company. Had to get a drug screening. Oh my god, it was just. Which, I mean, I expected all of it, but it's just kind of a shame that that's what this country's come to, that you gotta go through all that crap just to get a good, honest job. But it also explains why there's so many people still on welfare track, too. Because truth be known, most of them probably couldn't pass half the crap I had to do. Oh, and by the way, I think we've got the problem with these glasses narrowed down to the wrong SD card. The one I had in it was like a year old or something. And it wasn't basically it wouldn't take the info. 
information as fast as the camera was writing it, which is what made it all fuzzy, we think. So, I got a new HD top of the line sanded SD card for it. So, we'll have to see if that makes any difference or not. Otherwise, I'm at my wit's end. done. Even managed to get a couple in this wet or plant part of this wet spot. I had to go around a little hole there where dad got stuck yesterday and some tire tracks along the outside I didn't plant through but I got most of it so Check how long it took me. It's not bad. Pretty much exactly an hour. time it did that and I don't and I have absolutely no clue why hmm. Let's fix that when I get home it is warming up quick I can already just about lose my coat. The ground actually isn't as wet as it would appear from how much sticking to the drag change in the tires. It was we had a real heavy dew this morning, so the top of it was tacky from that, and then some of this is from going through that wet spot right there. ground's already drying out we've only had about we only had good sunlight on it for about 15 20 minutes so 
so I think it's time to go home and get some breakfast real quick and Cody ought to be here anytime so I'll go over and get rolling on or get him and dad rolling on that and get the drill over there and start drilling and I think I might there's that hay field's 11 acres and there's another eight acres right down the road from it that's going into beans. I think I'll get all, try to get all of it done today so I don't get to drive all the way back over there just for them another two fields, but. With any luck at all, we'll be planting corn this afternoon, so. I guess we'll just have to see what happens. We'll catch you guys later.